Hey guys, this is another really quick tutorial with my Urban Decay NYC palette. Um, just on, well, I'm planning on doing kind of like a, a series of wearable blues for brown eyes. Uh, and this will be the first one. Kind of like blue greens and stuff. Um, the blue that I'm going to be using is Height or Hate from Urban Decay. I will be using Suspect, Hate, and Smog. Okay. I know I did something very, very similar with Rockstar the other day, and it's all pretty much the same technique that I'm going to be using across the um, tutorials. So you can probably figure it out from now if you want to just switch off. Okay, um, so Suspect I will put on the inside of my lid and kind of stretch it out. I don't want to put too much product on the outside corner of my lid, but I will put a little bit on. Just kind of like the residue and put a little bit up to blend it out. For this one, I'm not even going to be using a blending brush. I'm going to try and try only to use the pencil brush and the um, eye shading brush just so that I can show you that you don't need to have the blending brush if you don't have it already. I'm going to put the height on the outer corner of my eyelid and through the crease. And kind of as I'm putting it on, I'm blending it in. Now I am making it a wearable blue by putting it with the suspect. So you're kind of dulling the blue, if you will. You're kind of like putting a, a kind of bronzy brown into the blue and changing the colour slightly. This is a great one for someone that hasn't worn blue before and you want to kind of experiment. Just kind of dragging it through into the suspect colour and kind of blending as you go and through the crease. I like to go a little higher than the crease. Okay, now I'm going to use smog on the underneath lash line. Difficult to use my camera. As a mirror, but it, but it's the best for tutorials. Is it like in a real mirror? Yeah. Okay, for colour, that's pretty much it. So anything really would do. Kind of like a mid shimmery blue that you can blend on the outer corner and the crease that you're kind of blending into a bronzy colour. I think perhaps I'll put a little bit more suspect in the corner. I've blended a little bit too far in maybe. Okay. Uh, then I'm going to use Urban Decay Eye Pencil in Zero. It's the 24-7 glide on pencil, which I love, and I saw the other day that they do so many different colours and I want them all. Uh, I'm going to put them at this halfway, my bottom line, and all the way, my top line. Oh, nearly just messed all of that up with his pencil. I'm going to have to close my eyes because I can't close one eye, it's a bit weird. And then a halfway. Yeah, that's about right. Okay, and mascara, which I am actually using. Where is it? This. I'm only using this end. It's the Gosh Lengthening Mascara. It's a really flexible applicator. And I only put it on my top lashes. I tend to get it a bit messy if I put it on my bottom lashes. I'm done. 
the light is not great for my face makeup and it makes my eyes <laughs> look really really blue and horrible and tired um but this is the best lighting that i could find for my eye makeup so what do you think I think, although it's blue, it still goes really, really nice with brown eyes, and um, it's just a little bit dramatic for daytime, but not quite dramatic enough for you not to be able to wear it. So, I hope you guys like it. Um, if you've got any requests, please let me know, and thanks for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe.